what if it is meant for you it will not miss you as we say in Jamaica what is for you can't be on for you so you must believe in yourself you must really get up off of the sidelines of your own life and get in there and fight for you Up with the jerk 
Virgo. Hello, this is um one of the cabanas at the beach. about to do right now. A nice dinner on the beach. This light is so bright. It looks like so hard and I see you every day working hard so I hope this trip is just a little way for me to say I appreciate you I love you happy birthday in a few minutes so 
I am pissed. <sighs> I just found out yesterday that most of my videos for the first couple of days have no sound. Like, there's no sound. I, I don't know how that happened, how I... It was a setting I had on the camera that I messed up. I don't know. But, so, the beginning of this whole video is going to be set to music. Or I'm going to do narration. Or I'm going to do music and narration. I'm going to figure it out. But I'm not going to give up. I'm going to use the footage. I'm going to make it do what it do. Hmm. Maybe I'll just do like a review of the Azul Hotel. I don't know. I'm going to figure it out. But right now, I'm looking rough. But that's okay. I'm about to go to the gym. Get my workout on. I feel good. I feel good. I feel so relaxed. Like this trip. Me and my baby. Yesterday we had such a good. Oh my gosh. That candlelight dinner. The food was amazing. Like that food was so good. I ordered salmon. Um, I think my husband. No, I know he had filet mignon. So good. So if you come to Azul, my friends, you must do that candlelight uh, beach dinner, whatever the hell they call it. It's a romantic dinner on the beach, whatever. It's delish. And get, did I see? That's what I be doing. Pressing stuff. What did I just press? So that food was so good. Then, everything, like honestly, at this hotel, my friends, all, every, everything we ate so far has been delicious. Like, they have really good food. Yesterday, we tried to go to a local restaurant, like off the resort. It's right next door to the resort though. So we're gonna try a different restaurant. But listen, Man, they try to charge us how much seventy dollars for a piece of black snapper. Never heard. Never heard of black snapper. First of all, second of all, seventy dollars for a fish two pounds, a two pound fish. And then when you look at the menu, the menu guys like. The menu said lobster was $30 and up or $35 and up. Something else. What was the second thing? Crab was $30 and up. And then everything else was $30, $30, $30, right? The fish, shrimp. But then, like, it was so crazy because, like, as the guy is telling us what is on the menu and what we can order, the prices are going up. <laughs> like, as he's talking, he's like, okay, so we don't have no $30 lobster. <laughs> oh, my God. The only lobster we have is $50. <laughs> I'm like, well, $40. And I'm like, okay, the lobster's $40. So... My husband was like, let me see it. Let me see the lobster. Let me pick my lobster. And he like, no mind. We have it in the back. Lobster's not in season. Okay. So what I'm guessing is he was trying to say he can't, he don't want to show them because they're not in season. But that still don't make sense because it's on the menu. It's on the menu. It's on your story. It's on the menu, so it really doesn't make sense that you like, it's not in season, but we got them in the back and you can't see it, but we're going to charge you $40. 
Huh? But but that was the place right next to the um the resort. So they lazy. They don't have to they don't have to work too hard because people that are not gonna venture too far away from the resort are gonna go right there, right? So they like we're gonna charge them whatever the fuck we want. So we need to go. Well, actually the good thing about this trip is we're staying on the resort until Friday and then we're going somewhere else. And the other place that we're going is more like in the town. So when we go over there, there's more opportunity, more restaurants around, and there's more competition for those restaurants. So because of that, they gotta you can just go next door or go down the street. So yeah, I need to keep the prices where they belong. Don't have a menu and then tell somebody else, tell somebody a completely different price and like with the menu that that is just now you're getting blatant with it and I, I was telling my husband you know he was looking too fly so they were thinking he was a superstar and they was giving him superstar prices <laughs> yeah, but that still is eh? You know, they be trying to get tourists, but you just got to stay in your ground. So what we did was we stood up like this and walked out. Because <laughs> guess what? We already paid for food. We're staying at an all-inclusive resort. We're trying, to, we're trying to patronize the local spots and y'all trying to come up. So you get no sale. Now, you're going to come outside with... <laughs> With your pet fish, talking about seventy dollars. They just kill him. <laughs> seventy dollars. I'm like, first of all, I just I didn't say like. I said, well, how much? What fish do you have? And you come out with. <laughs> And you bring the, I'm like, I didn't say I want fish. I just wanted to know what the choice was. Like, what, it says fish on the menu. What kind of fish? He go on the back and grabs his pet fish that he been growing for two years, kills it, and tries to charge us, <laughs> and try to charge us $70 for the fish. <laughs> Ciao. I'm like, try somebody else on a different day. I am not. There's other restaurants. This place is filled with seafood restaurants. We just are in. We're on the, I don't, I don't know if this is the north or the east. I don't know. But we're further out this way, away from Rick's. So if you use Rick's as a guide, the Rick's Cafe is all the way at the other end. And we're all the way at this end. So when we're in the middle where we're going to be this weekend when we have to buy food anyway um, we're going to be closer to the town and I think that's when we'll be able, not think, I know that's when we'll be able to get the lobster that my baby wants This dude, he's like, ooh, let's see we how much money we can get out of that. So one thing about Azul is they do not have any elevators. So if you have any knee problems, back problems, you don't like climbing stairs, don't come here. Look at that. Ready for us. Empty. Yeah, I like that. We in this building right here now. So we right next to the gym. I like to, that's 
When you come out and see this, hallelujah, look at it, look at it, God just you see, yes, all right, we, we're going to get the change now, change, Bust it down. Yeah, that, that dinner the dinner was, was great. Excellent. Yeah. Um, we trying to get changed. We trying to get changed. Change. Change. You want to break these up a little bit? I'm not sure if that's can break it up here in Jamaica. Hi. Can you break these into 500s? Yeah. Ooh. All right, we are we're going to eat, I think. Well, not think, I know. What is this? Is this a... What's palms? Is this a buffet here? It is. It is? They got eggs, they got bacon. Shit. I got to walk all the way down. All the way down, man. Well, we got our reservations for the Italian. We have to... Oh, that's what we should have asked, too. Bacon, sausage, tomato, scrambled eggs. And I'm just looking to see what they have. They have pastries, bagels, kiev, muffins, a whole bunch of pastries, breads. 
so you can make toast. But sometimes I, I get a bit shy, you know? Into <laughs> um, almond. You said mm, cheese? No cheese. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Have an excellent day. I'm going to do an almond. Give me one second. Sure. Sarah. They have a whole bunch of stuff to put on their things. They got Nutella, banana jam, peanut butter, and papaya chutney. Yeah. 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 Egg. Yeah. French toast. Yeah. Fish. You didn't see this French toast sign right here? They got bacon, sausage, is this fish, potatoes, tomato, steamed vegetables, and egg. So we found a buffet <laughs> right next to our room. I already start eating. But we both started eating already, but I'm gonna show you what we got. <laughs> we both got omelets. Same thing. I got spinach, kalaloo, tomatoes, like. Scotch bonnet, pepper, mushrooms, cheese, all kinds of stuff. It's delicious. Okay. And then we got, and then I got this, this thing here is like a banana fritter, fritter. It's delicious. Some cabbage, bacon, sausage with onions. And a couple of potatoes. And maybe got French toast, which he said is the softest French toast. Same sausage, bacon, and the banana fritter. And so, what are we eating in the next couple of days, you said? Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. They just explained to us that it's mango season. So, that's why you're seeing. A zillion flies in the background. Mm -hmm. It's like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like getting it all out your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> the food last night, yo. Can't see what's like after. <laughs> like, who that, the uncle? My man, what was his name? That cooks? Yeah. I don't remember. But yeah, his food Andrew. was good. Andrew. Excellent. Andrew can cook, you know. So anybody that watched this video that's from Azul, Andrew that's do, that cooks the food for your beach. Um, you need a raise. Dinners, he needs a raise. My man, Ross Gamba. You need a raise. You need a raise. Like, he made us these delicious burgers. Like, mad delicious. I think they, I think he made jerk burger. Because it was like a spicy but sweet kick. He put everything on it. He toasted the bun. A1. He did not rush. He warmed our fries back up. You saw that? You need a raise. You need a raise. Okay.
I need a tag on the tag on the door. I am in the in the in the vlog I'm gonna tag. Going to the swim up bar, but we're not getting in the pool though. <laughs> we're gonna get a drink and then we're gonna head to the beach. One thing about us is if there's a if there's a beach nearby, I'm probably not gonna get in the pool. I might, but then I might not. A Jamaican, what the hell's a shot? Four kings of that thing. Woo. It's a Bobby Lahan. I drank how many of those? Three? Okay, so this is the bathroom at the Zoo Beach Resort by the pool to check out this bathroom. Let me show you. It has three stone molds, four stones. Very nice, clean bathroom. They have hand soap here. Two sinks. Yes. The grounds at the grill. In this resort, a zoo beach resort, a beautiful. A Vivian, Vivian, yes. Vivian, make it beautiful. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And, it, and everything I do, I do it with fashion. That's right, and it, it shows. Uh, oh my. It really shows. Okay. Be proud of yourself. You know my mom. Yeah, yeah. She loves garden. To, to garden. Oh. Okay. She was born in Jamaica. She was born in St. James, though, oh. in Montego, Bay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. She was born in there. Okay, Over that's there. very nice. Very yeah. nice. Very nice. Okay, my friend. Enjoy your day, <laughs> Thank my you friend. Thank you so much. Okay, my friend. We picked up some lunch. Yeah. Yeah. Some salsa yeah. burger. Mexican burger. So we got On our way to the Italian restaurant, I do not know the name, but it's across the way over there. Everyone we've been talking to has been saying it's been really, really hot, like even hotter than usual. So, I guess global warming is real. I hope they got AC. It's over here, man. Bye. We're having a great time. We recommend this resort. <laughs> yes.
is. going for the shrimp first because those are like muzzles or something. Mm. You are right, man. Nice and fresh. What sauce is this? Did they give you very little? Very little. I have the other shrimp, baby, and the crab piece, that big piece of crab. You can have it. I'm eating these. <laughs> you don't want it. Today starts our last full day at Azulu. I must say, we've had a great time. I bet you guys can guess where I'm headed. Yes, I'm going to the gym. I'm headed down to the gym. Which, since we moved, since we moved rooms, the gym is like super close to where my room is. Yay! The gym is like right here. Albie's gonna meet me down here. We don't have a lot of time. We kind of slept in a little bit. It's like it's like 10 o'clock right now. So definitely <laughs> slept in. And ooh, it's warm. It's, it's every day is warm though. It's hot. We in Jamaica. And it feels like you in Jamaica. Yeah, so here's the gym. What am I gonna do today? No real idea. But we only have 30 minutes. Weight. No weight, sorry. That does body weight exercises. And it's a full body workout. I'm gonna do three exercises three or four times. Not sure yet how long. How I'm gonna feel. And then that's it. We're done. Because I wanna catch breakfast. No, no, it's fat and lazy. But I do, though.
You have more skins that I can help but tell you. Ladies and gentlemen. This is really my happy place, y'all. If you don't work out, get on it, y'all. This will change your life. It's tremendous cream. Still took gas strap with infrared beams. We made it. That was a good workout. Uh, get out of my face. <coughs> you didn't get to really get into your room. Mm. You ain't moving, baby. Mm. I got fish. I have sauce. You got me? Thank you so much. Here we go, and you make a good omelet. I want to see it. Same thing we got yesterday is shrimp omelet. We got kalaloo, it don't have spinach. It has kalaloo, mushrooms, scotch bonnet, cheese, sun dried tomatoes. So we eating eggs, but we eating it with the Jamaican flair. <laughs> Oh, we gotta go to the front desk and ask them for the checkout. But we will have to. I'm gonna pack it up real quick. I'm not gonna take one. Good morning, my sister. Oh, can you hear me? I'm good. I'm in Jamaica. This is my first I was just filming it. Nice. You are. You made me a movie star. Once again, <laughs> I don't like this hat, but it does the job, honey. It does the job, and that's all. But you know what? Today, the sun don't seem like it's too heavy. Like yesterday, yesterday, we had to retreat. We was on the beach. That sun was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Back up off the beach. And that's what we did, back up off the beach.
But today, there's a lot more cloud coverage. I hope it doesn't rain, though. But, look at that. Yes. Just waiting on my man. Here we come. Oh, we gotta go to the gift shop. I don't know if I showed y'all the gift shop. I'm going to show it to you right now. So since we moved, we lot more central. So we're closer to the gift shop, to the restaurants, a buffet, the pool, the bars, everything. It's like central. And the gym. We're closer to the gym here on the side. Because the gym is by building one and two in the back. Woo! I thought the sun was chilling. I must have been, I was in the shade. That sun lets you know where you are, for sure. It wasn't pink, baby. That one didn't really fit, remember? It was that tropical looking one. Yeah. Not the pink one. Drink time. Make 
make sure your skincare game is up before you come to Jamaica. There's no makeup. It's gonna make melon down your neck. <laughs> it's hot. I'm gonna go over there by the, the deck. Michael Jackson show. Jamaicans love Michael Jackson. Every resort you go to, they do a Michael Jackson show. Oh, oh. Wow, he's really good.